Here's the breaking news. Yes, a gunfire shooting in downtown Kansas City, Missouri on Thursday resulted in the death of at least one person and injured 21 others at a parade to celebrate the Super Bowl victory of the NFL championships, causing panic among the crowds as they sought safety. The gunfire which happened near a garage close to the station took place towards the conclusion of the victory rally following a parade, according to the police writers reported. Police Chief Stacy Graves disclosed during a press conference that three individuals were detained and were under investigation in connection with the incident outside Union Station, a landmark in the city. Graves said that investigators have not determined a motive for the shooting yet. Fire Department Chief Ross Grunstrom said during a news briefing that at least 22 individuals were struck by gunfire, resulting in one fatality. He added that 15 of the wounded sustained life threatening injuries. Griffiths acknowledged reports suggesting that some fans may have been involved in pursuing and apprehending at least one of the suspects. Investigators are actively reviewing video footage of the incident. She said, as per AP, I am angry. At what happened today, the people who came to this celebration should expect a safe environment. Approximately 800 law enforcement officers, including FBI agents and personnel from the Federal Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, Firemen, and Explosives, were present at the rally and parade preceding it. According to a statement from the National Football League team, all Chiefs players, coaches, and staff who attended the victory rally were confirmed to be safe. Even hours after the incident, authorities were still in the process of determining the exact number of casualties and gathering details Reuters reported. Footage shared on social media depicted chaos unfolding outside the station as numerous uniformed police officers armed and with weapons drawn rushed into the building while crowds of breastfeeders scattered in the opposite direction. Kansas City has faced persistent challenges with gun violence, leading to its selection as one of nine cities by the U.S. Justice Department for intensified efforts to combat violent crime in 2020. By 2023, the city experienced a troubling milestones, reaching a record equaling number of 182 homicides with the majority involving firearms. 